There's Tesla in EVs, NVIDIA in AI. But have you heard of IONQ? The first publicly traded pure play quantum computing company, aiming to be the NVIDIA of the quantum era. Founded in 2015 in College Park, Maryland, by Duke and UMD professors Christopher Monroe and Jung Sang Kim, IONQ spun out decades of trapped ion research and went public in 2021 on the NYSE as IONQ. IONQ builds quantum systems like ARIA with 25 qubits, Forte with 36 qubits, and the data center-ready Forte Enterprise. Their next machine, Tempo, aims for 64 qubits. Using trapped ion technology, IONQ offers long coherence times, low error rates, and all-to-all -all connectivity. Their systems are accessible via AWS, Azure Quantum, Google Cloud, and the IONQ Cloud. In 2025, IONQ demonstrated quantum-beating classical and real-world blood pump simulations with ANSYS, showing 12% performance gains. They're also developing compact XHV systems for broader deployment. IONQ opened facilities in Washington State and Europe, deployed its Forte Enterprise system in Switzerland, and was recognized by Forbes, Newsweek, and built in as a top mid-cap company in workplace. In June 2025, IONQ announced a $1.08 billion acquisition of Oxford Ionics to accelerate its path to fault-tolerant quantum systems. Their bold roadmap, 256 qubits by 2026, 10,000 plus by 2027, and 2 million by 2030. The vision is bold, but the finances are tough. Q1 2025 revenue was $7.6 million against a $32 million loss. Still, with $697 million cash and new $22 million deals like the EPB Quantum Hub, IONQ is pushing forward. If quantum truly revolutionizes industries like drug discovery, cybersecurity, and logistics, IONQ could become the NVIDIA of the quantum age. Will they deliver or remain a dream? This was LOL Street Story. Don't forget to check the description for books and resources about quantum computing and IONQ's bold journey.